can sort of translate into the vertex. Good lord! Nope, not the lord, just your more realistic version. I'm Peter Bowman Sigma, a student from and the reality is, putting in work is not so pretty. You know what is pretty? You're hacking and building. Let me tell you more about what I do. During quarantine, I was left deeply unsatisfied when I discovered on-demand deliveries and environmental repercussions. Thus, for WRO 2021, I co-founded UpDrop, an autonomous electric drone delivery service. Our working product consisted of a 3D printed cage custom designed on Fusion 360, a lowering mechanism encompassing a double rack and pinion actuator controlling an automated set of claws, and a proximity detection system utilizing a bottom facing camera and IR lock sensor capable of detecting infrared positioning frequencies, which we outputted from the IR emitter beacon placed on a retractable origami inspired circular solar charging hub. We encountered problems supplying power and signals to our stepper motor, prompting us instead to create a physical H bridge via servo and four limit switches to power a geared DC motor. The brain of our onboard flight controller connecting to the updrop mobile app was embedded Raspberry Pi, while its spinal cord employed pulse width modulation to send and coordinate signals to all circuits. For integration, we custom designed a two-story structure on CAD and used a wide array of languages and frameworks to design a robust communications architecture. Ultimately, we partnered with the DHL Global Innovation Center and qualified for the international final of WRO, taking home the world's second place finish. Not too long ago, the results was indicated. An all-in-one productivity system input to over 30,000 users before scaling to a distributed team of 15 across eight countries. The core of our system was built in a custom hosted WebSocket, enabling real-time document collaboration and other nifty features. I'm constantly on the lookout for the next build to open source and tinker with. From my very own silly blue simulator to accidentally holding the world's record for the longest book when experimenting in computational linguistics and universal grammar theory with Markov chains. In a world of great distraction, I choose building with a humanist passion.